This is a cathode ray tube. Inside, there's nothing uh, inside. They, it's actually a vacuum tube. Uh, so there's nothing but a vacuum on the inside. Uh, and it's called a cathode ray tube because this is the anode and this is the cathode. Uh, when it's hooked up to an electric current, like I'm about to do here, you can see a beam moving across. You might think it's light, but when you take a magnet to light, does it do this? You can see that it's bending or deflecting away from the magnet, so we know that it's not actually um, light. What J.J. Thompson summarized was that he was seeing a piece of an atom flying from one end of the cathode ray tube to the other, and that the piece of the atom that he was seeing was negative based on the end of the magnet that um, was causing a repulsion. So the negative end of the magnet was causing a repulsion, therefore the particles must be negative.